Yeah, this way. That was some good barbecue. Definitely made up for all the troubles uh, from today. There's always a silver lining to everything. Right now we're gonna go make sure we got the room reserved and then we're gonna head over to uh, downtown Houston and see what we can uh, check out just to uh, uh, you know, be tourists for a little bit uh, for one more day. Check what's in here. <laughs> oh, you eat it. Oh my god, it's so big! Oh wow. It's crazy. Money, 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 money! This one's cool because they oh my god. Because it has a theme, yeah? Hey there. Oh, look at this one. Yeah. Look, it looks nasty. Looks, looks stupid. No eyes, it looks like no? It, it does. It has the eyes. Look at the one on the bottom. No, solo puedes ver los dientes cuando, cuando, cuando hay comen. algo. Cuando te comen. Oh, fancy. Oh, look at that big ass puffer fish. Wow. These are, these are so small compared to that one. It's a potato. Oh, they have an actual white tiger. Oh, two of them. Hey, oh, so cute. Too bad it could kill me. That's pretty. Okay, dale. Ahí, ahí, ahí. Dale. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Let me see it. Oh my God. <laughs> wow. They are hungry. They missed the one that she put in. <laughs> you gotta put your hand in. Ooh. You gotta put your what in there? No, you gotta put your in there. Where is there? Where is there? No wonder they're coming out here. Oh, that's creepy looking. <laughs> During our journey today, please remain seated, keeping your arms, hands, legs, and head inside the train coach the train is in motion. It will take us around the entire seven acres situated along Houston's Buffalo Bayou.
Mira. Este. Look, it's an actual car. I can't wait. It's a space center here. Yeah. It's a space center, yeah. Okay. It's too late. Alright guys, we're finally back. Our plan to use Uber to go to the airport and park at the military base worked perfectly. Uh, it was really cheap. It definitely feels like we're back in Hawaii. Uh, there's no comparison with the heat. Uh, even though Manzanillo was hot, it was really humid and uh, Hawaii not so much. We are heading back to the house to drop off the luggage and I'm most likely later on I'm going to go to Costco and uh, grab some groceries. I'm pretty sure I gained about 10 minimum, uh, probably 20 pounds on this last month. Uh, so I'm gonna weigh myself right now when I get home and uh, and hopefully I was, the damage is not too bad. It's gonna work as a good gauge of on how fast I can get back into ketosis. Uh, obviously, I'm gonna start going strict keto again. Let's see how long it takes me to get back into that weight that I was before I started cheating and before we went on vacation. Lisa, Lisa. Huh? Hey guys, so I'm back at it again. I just finished my first wedding since I got back yesterday. I was actually supposed to have a wedding yesterday, but because we got held up in Houston, we had to, I had to cancel that one. Last night, I didn't record anything because I was just uh, super tired. I still had to go get groceries uh, so that we can cook the girls' bentos for school today. Uh, and so uh, by the time I got home, I just pretty much crashed. Uh, but I did weigh myself and I was at 253, which is the almost the exact weight that I, that I was when I came back from California last year. I'm not too worried about it because like I said, I've been cheating the vacations. I uh, basically just ignore all diets uh, and I ate to get stuffed every day. But for now, we gotta get back to the house, unpack all our luggage, take the stuff out that we put away when we left. Cuter and annoying at the same time. <laughs> 